<clears throat> do 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 do. <clears throat> Man, I need to clean my freaking desk, dude. There's just tons of shit here. I mean, it's not tons. I could literally just. Oh. Oh, that didn't work as well as I thought it would. Oh, that's for future me's problem. Oh, that is future me's problem. Three for three! Happy birthday, by the way. Thank you. Oh, and I actually have chat in the right place. I didn't even notice. I thought I turned it. Pinata? Dude, smacking things is my absolute best. I mean, smacking things is my best trait. It like you beat women in DBFC. There we go. This year. That's if we're going to be playing this game next year. You underestimate my power. <laughs> my fat ass. Family size? More like fun size. You're correct. It is a very easy birthday date to remember. In fact, I almost forgot this year anyway. What's that? Catch bugs. Okay. We can do that.
Shame no one can do that now because of the situation. Shit, 10 cupcakes. Can we plant them? Let's make some cupcake trees, honestly. Cool. Dude, I got two cakes. It's the perfect day. Sorry, I don't want to chop your head off. That's for later. <laughs> Fucking Power Ranger suit, dude. Hit him. <laughs> oh, he gave us. He usually wasn't like bitching to me about anything. He was just giving me a new reaction. Thank you. Very appreciative. Oh yeah, we got the campsite. Yeah, just gonna destroy some trees on the way there. Honestly, 10 cupcakes? Yeah, that's, that's pretty... I don't think I could eat 10 cupcakes. I could probably eat... Sounds like weak sauce numbers, but I'd probably eat like 3 if I had to. And that's if I had to eat them. I'll probably only eat like two normally. Thank you for the earth egg. site completely devoid of people I'll probably just buy uh, most of uh, Mabel's stock Because I would like her to set up shop here. Would be nice. Also, I'm finally get, starting to get trees that actually, I actually planted like 20 days ago. Dark wood and then some eggs. You couldn't get any more useless.
Wait, where are the fossils at? I suppose they won't be anywhere near the uh, the main island. Let's go put these cakes down in the dungeon. Get some of that dungeon cake, you know? Oh, no, that's not, that's not dungeon cake. I actually have to hold it. Or there's a limit to it. You can't just spam it on and off. Big shame. I think it's the first time we've gotten pairs since we got them the first time. we craft a bird cage I'm not wait to craft a bird cage Ooh. I also haven't seen apples in a long time we plant some more apples actually Now, where do we craft an apple tree? Craft? Make. I'm gonna put one here. Or we can eat it. That's also good. Oh yeah, it wants us to catch, catch bugs. I mean that's that's it's easy peasy dude. But possibly the easiest quest you've ever given me, in fact. Finally some fossils. And not freaking eggs, dude. Dude the complaint about the eggs, the line is hilarious. I mean, I, I agree with it. You get too many freaking eggs. But I still think it's funny. Nintendo pushes one update. And everyone's like, please, just want resources. But I'm looking for those. Not those in specific, just, you know, bugs. There we go. I suppose we'll go up here and look for stones. Stones and bugs. Could have called that dude. I just wasn't paying attention. Go. Cool. <clears throat> 
can't remember if this is true or not. It might be. I vaguely remember it. I think that I share a birthday with Tammy. I think it's the artist of Undertale. They're also the owner of the, you know, Tammy character. There's also a few other people I remember who have uh, an April 4th birthday. I see, I remember, but it's not all. Oh. oh, that was the money one as well. Damn. Yeah, I say I remember, uh, but I don't. More like I recall. It's a much more accurate version to say. Share birthday with Robert Downey Jr. That was one of them. I am Iron Man. Only stone. There's a, a lot of stone, no... Oh. Did I miss one? Heath Ledger. Oh, it's top of the hour. Oh wait, is it... What time is it? It's four. It's not five. At five you get this absolute tune. So this is a tune as well. Should have put it with the fucking grumpy cat. Now that is epic. Sorry, flowers. My running cannot be stopped. I'll invoke my stampede. I don't think we have this yet. Stink bug. It lives up to its name. You call it stinky? You're rude? You can't just call a bug stinky, it's rude. Uh-oh, Stinky. Uh-oh, Stinky. I want to hit it to actually get this stuff down. But I suppose I'll smack it with my axe. I mean, I actually can't get them done with that. Got him. Don't moving. Got him. Do you know something that's mildly frustrating? The fact that I can't get any more uh, HDVR apps. No, no, H Jesus, what the fuck? Any more uh, My Hero Academia episodes on uh, Pirate Bay? They're just not updating. Actually, that's not true. The actual the dub for season four is 
really behind. Like, b more behind than it's ever been. Which is understandable. But also the episodes were leaked, so I don't see why they wouldn't be... It's the prime place to put them on, on Pirate Bay. When they were... Then when they're leaked. When, since when did Pirate Bay people have morals? And didn't upload leaked episodes? Not really a big problem, I can just go into a site that does have them. Season 4 is covering a hell of a lot more than I thought it would. Like, it almost seems like they're rushing it. Is there covering arcs I didn't even think they would get to? only get to from the overhaul arc to the remedial force arc but they ended the remedial course arc at like episode 19 or something well episode, technically episode 20 or 21 but in between that they also had uh, another major fight I didn't think they would get to And then episode 20, 25, or 24, 25, 26. It's covering a fight I was expecting in the next season. For sure. 100%. Oh, wow. A very ugly doll you got there. Uh, I actually didn't have that much to sell. Understandable. Should have checked the hot item of the day. Also should have checked the actual shop. I thought I said 7,000 bells. Wait, holy, sh holy shit, we, we can become Manetta. You got it, Sonic. Again, from what I heard, the more you buy, the more likely she is to actually set up a shop. I'm kind of just buying everything she has. I'm not sure if I'm wanting the banana hat, though. I mean, I guess we give enough storage, we might as well take it. Give me it all. I'll take your entire stock. Gah. I guess I will take the grape hat. You can become a Sporticus to try to be the, the superhero on the run. I 
I think that's it. We already have striped socks, so we don't really need the stalks. Epic bug moment. We're gonna get our fossils assessed. Ooh, spending bells. Oh, a bit further back. No, no. I'm pretty sure I crafted that thing yesterday. I probably didn't. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah, we can give gifts to them now. I still don't understand what they mean by giving uh, coconut trees a good smack. Quite nice. It actually is, does look quite nice. I wonder where uh, the big, big one is. Large. They're in their home? Yep. You can see the lights are on. Sick. Give cupcake, get present. It's the economy of life. Yeah, that actually matches. Is there there's uh trunks and what's your face I wonder if there's a way to change the color of clothes I'd imagine to the customize option but hey, you can actually read I'm not hyped up for bunny day can I not give you a cupcake? No. No. Yes, no. What do you have in there? Oh, it's just a normal butterfly. 
I couldn't tell because its wings were uh, fully up. And we should have gone to Blathers first. So we'll go do that. We shall go to Blathers and give him these fossils. And this insect. Which he'll love. Hey, sleepy boy. Assess fossils. I would like to actually donate them. And we will donate the bugs separately. Now, this amazing bug. How do they live with themselves? Bells to buy items. Why couldn't you give me that like literally five minutes ago when I was spending all my freaking bells, dude? Oh, hang on. Putting a drink. Okie Yeah, for a piece dress, I was expecting something a bit more extravagant. Oh, I suppose simplicity is the best. Right, Pat. <laughs> Dude, you can actually just become Mineta. Fishing vest? Is it time for some fishing memes? I'll save the rest of it for stuff I want to sell. I don't think I really want a uh, the dinosaurs. We also need to make another uh, slingshot. 
Although we can just buy one. For like 800 bells. It's actually just a Power Ranger suit. Epic. Dude, I got so many freaking, oh my god. So many flowers. Which kind of looks nice. I mean, get rid of the, you know, that. Should we wear the freaking Power Ranger suit? We actually should. Let's do it, boys. Man, it looks silly. It looks so silly. <laughs> That was almost too silly. I don't know why I'm hitting trees. We really don't need wood at this point. I guess just have it. I think we've explored every inch of the island. We should also ask- oh shit, what's hot? Because if it's something we have a lot of resources for, that could be pretty lucrative. Where is... there's one. I'll just buy one because I can't be asked making it. Oh. Damn. So what it would take from my my savings or something. Would have been nice. Yeah, April 12th, please get here faster. <laughs> Open these epic waffles. No, he actually wants to talk to me. He's not just sitting there.
I guess we could just kind of do whatever we want to do. There's no underlying objective. Oh, so we're going to change it because it looks ridiculous. It looks hilarious. Go with this. Because it, it did look pretty good. The coat really helps. Probably go to a uh, another island. Get some resources from there. Cause we're we're actually not as high as I'd like to be in terms of rocks and rocks primarily. What does our nook mouse want us to do? Catch a wasp, catch fish, catch a red sniper, plant trees. searching for fossils yesterday yeah like the day before and the day after what's it gonna do I still didn't even check what the hot item was by the way it's so painfully easy to just get immediately sidetracked medium cardboard boxes I can see uh, turnips are kind of a buy them for a low price sell them for a high price that's what it looks like to me because they because they constantly fluctuating price but also where the fuck do I buy turnips buy turnips that's it's the first question you need to have a daisy may visit your island you can, uh, she will visit on sundays oh uh, i guess we just wait until tomorrow tomorrow am i am i am i wrong oh, no okay jesus i guess we just wait until tomorrow where we can, uh, buy a bunch of turnips. Our wire fence, material fence. Yeah, that fountain's pretty nice. Shit. Horrible toilet boys. We in. Yeah, I'll probably be uh, more inclined to 
Buy a lot of those or they work with Nuke Moss? I need my Nuke Moss for, for tickets, you know? No? And we shall... What are you doing here? Lishmancy? I would like to fly. Man, his head has such a weird texture. It's like a carpet. You probably can't see it because of the stream compression. But he's got an oddly carpet-like texture. I'm guessing Wilbur also has it. Just the, that's uh, just the, the dodo head texture. Yeah. I guarantee you they are actually just the same model. What if they're the same person? What did dodos do? Go extinct? Oh, look at those, look at those rocks. <gasps> we gotta get to them. You teasy tease. Surely we can get to them. Well, the bridge, we don't have a bridge. And bridges take uh, a day to complete. Just reminded, there was a YouTuber I used to watch. I, f I completely forgot their name. They also did ex well, not extremely generic, but it was what everyone else was kind of doing at the time. I think they were doing Amnesia Custom Stories. I wonder if they became really popular. It would surprise me in the slightest if I checked their channel again after I remembered their name, and they had like. 400,000 subscribers. Either that or their last upload was like five years ago. That's also the option. I bet we can get to it from uh, from there. By breaking that rock. Or we need the island construction kit. I'm never going to remember their name.
Like, I don't even know where to start with it. Oh, I... I, oh, I think I favorited one of their videos. That's a, that's a, that's the solution. Let's go to find that. Easy solution. Ooh. I'm surprised there was no uh, wasps on this island. No nests. We're not going to get anything from this, by the way. So maybe we can get to the island from here. Yas. Do y'all remember the Bionicles? Remember when they tried rebooting them in like 2015 and then no one cared, unfortunately? It's a shame. I actually bought one of the reboot ones. Because at the time I was, uh... I basically, I had, I had like several boxes of Bionicles that were incomplete and they weren't really, uh... So they were just kind of like hum jum jumbled mess of parts. So I thought, hey, why don't we uh, build them, you know? Build them, put them back in their case, uh, and then uh, you know keep them fully built. Oh, this is a money one? Yeah, I'd spent uh, a really long time just putting them together again. It took about maybe a week of just constant building. It was also, we had to find all the parts because we had every single part within each other. Not within each other, in the same, uh, oh. In the same pile. So it was kind of just like, well, what part fits, you know? It's kind of like you were building 20 Lego sets at once. Dude, this is some dude's freaking hidden treasure. Actual abandoned island hidden treasure. So once I completed all of them, I thought, hey, let me buy a new one. One of the ones that just came out like uh, a month ago and build it and see how it compares to the rest of them. And I built it and I was like, okay, that's cool. And I put it away in this box with the rest of them and that's forever where they stand. I actually don't know where they are now. They're somewhere. Yeah, 
eat. We get this island all the time, by the way. This island is great. I have a, I have a feeling my shovel's about to break. You know, I just got this gut feeling. We are like, I know it's gonna happen. It didn't. You know, I kind of want to make some some Doom custom maps. Last night I was like, you know, I got a few cool ideas. I got a few a few things I'd like to do. And supposedly the uh, Doom map maker is one of the easiest to work with. I was like, maybe, maybe I could try it at some point. Might be pretty fun. I was about to say, Jesus, don't give me three eggs. Three eggs is bad luck. I wonder, do you get anything from shaking palm trees? Finally, that's coming back for Eternal. The, uh, the map maker. Because I was talking about, like, uh, the original Doom. Making some maps for the original. Some wads. At the egg moment. I've seen a mod that has Isabelle as a companion. There's a lot of crazy stuff you can do with uh, Doom mods. Is this the Egg Ocean? It's actually just the egg ocean. Hmm. Oh yeah. Forgetting these exist. We've also got two more to go. I guess we're missing Angry? We're missing Angry and something else. This is just Egg Island. Thank you for seeing it. Finally. I 
epic fish moment. Is that Nemo? You're Nemo. Oh, it's not Nemo! Oh, this is the this is finding Dory now. And they they have such a weird name, sturgeon uh, sturgeon fish. Was it sturgeon fish? Sturgeon fish? I just saw it. Sturgeon fish. Surgeon. There was surgeon. Why are they called surgeon surgeon fish? I should actually ask. That's the perfect to ask blathers, actually. For real though, finding Dory as a a movie. I actually really really liked Finding Dory. It had a bit weird pacing, but uh, like a bit weird pacing, a bit weird structure. It kind of ends a bit abruptly, but it's a really fun movie. It's really great. Pretty worthy sequel. You get your sunfish, mackerel. sure finding Nemo introduced a ton of people to fish species and I guarantee literally no one would care about surgeon fishes if it wasn't for for Dory people will probably still care about clown fishes because clown fishes What do we do first? Do we sell or do we go to Blathers? Then we go to Blathers. Then we uh, go to our house and then we sell. One of us a reference. Maybe. Nintendo does like to sneak in a bunch of references every now and then. You know, I'm really glad that he doesn't actually just stay asleep. Because I'm pretty sure in the previous Animal Crossing games, he just... If you came to him during the day... Hang on. <laughs> Excuse me. If you came to him during the day, he just didn't respond. He was sleeping all the time. Maybe they're called surgeon fishes because they have a blade. Then. Their fins maybe look like a, a blade or something. Hmm. 
I would like to donate. We haven't donated, donated a horse macro yet. Hey, tell me about the horse mackerel then. I would like to donate the horse mackerel and Dory. Give the ladder lock up tight. People will try and break her out. I really should get a proper Ethernet cable, so my uh, my bitrate stays completely consistent. Put the weeds away, uh, and we'll see what we can sell. Right. So the na uh, knife draw, the horse mackerel, the wasp. We've lost lots of weeds, we don't need them. We've lost lots of flowers, we also don't need them. Don't need these. Oh, this fucking wood. Oh my god. How much is that? Hopefully we get a pretty penny for that, actually. That seems like a lot of stuff. Uh, but knowing, what's it called? The Timmy Brothers. It's, it's not gonna sell for much. I'm gonna estimate... 12k. <clears throat> That's my final offer, 12k. Probably a little bit more. Old ass phone. I know, right? It's the type of phone you leave in your in your kitchen. No, I'm estimating a bit more than 12k. I'm estimating uh 16. Um, I was way off. <laughs> Miles off. Wait, we can pay our rent. I think. Oh.
awfully lucrative. I wonder what the uh, the ones we haven't gotten yet is. Rent is due. Ready to pay his pull back. Oh, so we can pay it. Oh, we have to pay it from here. No, not redeem Nuke Miles. The button mashing. Bomb. Jesus <gasps> fuck. Also, I know for a fact you can get four rooms, an upstairs, a downstairs. We're just moving on to the second room. We've still got a third room. Upstairs and downstairs to go. How freaking much is he gonna charge me? Come with a pretty uh, pink aesthetic so far. May as well. Dude, how freaking much is he gonna charge for the rest of it? Freaking insane. I'm guessing he's gonna put it to the left. Actually, no, this game is Japanese. So, if we're getting an extra room, estimate which side is it gonna be on the right or the left? This game is Japanese, so I'm gonna say the right. Well, my gut tells me left. We need to make another fishing rod. I think we actually even need much. We just need that. I mean, if it's on the right, it's gonna be blocked by my fish, but you know. Oh, there's a freaking hard knife jaw in here. I didn't even notice. Hmm. 
Order, can we customize clothes? I don't think we can, but I would like to see. Oh, I meant to customize. No. But you can customize your shovel. For some reason. the opportunity to actually build the house properly, you know? Start thinking about actually designing the house. Because we have so many resources we may as well. Egg dungeon. Get that cake. This is this is epic theme. What time is it? It is five. We get the epic theme, the best theme. Don't be egg. Fuck you. I would like to get another Nook Miles ticket so we can. Because uh, oh. that island was fun. We didn't get much uh, resources in terms of iron or shit. But we got enough money to pay for our loan. It was nice. Dude, it'd be hilarious if we could pay for our loan uh, as soon as we asked for it. So he's like, hey, 50, 58,000 bells. Or sorry, 580,000 bells. And you're like, okay. And you just dump it on the counter. And he's like, what the fuck? You just paid for a loan, dude. He's like, yeah. I know. Thick stacked. I'm surprised there's no uh, Nook Miles thing for going on trips or using Nook Miles tickets. And I'm confident we've literally used like two or three a day. I'm 
That would put us at least at like 30. No. Probably closer to 20. I remember this island. Do I? Yeah. I'm pretty sure we've been on it. Give me my axe. Dude, at least wasps can't fall out of this. I think. I'm not gonna say they can't, because I guarantee as soon as I say that, one's gonna pop out. But it wouldn't surprise me if they couldn't spawn from bamboo trees. It just wouldn't make sense, you know? It would be silly. So if we shake these trees, what do we get? Jack? We get Jack? Alright, well, I guess we get nothing. On Epic. Oops. Nah, no, not that one either. This one. Gotta cycle through the entire bunch. I don't want egg. Probably end the stream after this uh, this island. I started way too late, unfortunately, because I was fucking tired and I decided, fuck, it, I'm gonna sleep. But then I still wanted to play Animal Crossing, so I played anyway. tools. I think we also need a, uh, another one. There's no wood on this island, dude. Actually, no, there is. The question is, will we get enough?
Let's see how lucky we are. Like all these weed. Do we know if uh, Predator Hunting Grounds is coming not? Is, is not exclusive to the Epic Store? Like a timed exclusive? I know it's a timed exclusive. No, I know it's an exclusive, but I don't know if it's a timed exclusive. If it's not a, a timed exclusive, then I'm never playing it. But if it is, then I might play it. We haven't had a, a proper Predator game in a, in a long time, dude. I remember playing the uh, AVP Requiem game on my PSP. Back when the PSP was relevant, you remember that? Okay, saying back when the PSP was relevant is not an accurate statement because the PSP was never relevant. Genuinely never. That game was real fun. Kinda miss it. I, I guarantee I would play it though, and I'd be like, yeah, this is kinda shy. <laughs> I probably wouldn't miss it. Seems timed. Oh, I know it's going to PC. I just mean it's going to the Epic Store on PC. I don't know if it's an Epic Store exclusive. Because if it isn't coming to Steam, uh, I don't really care. I don't know. It's also available right now in the Epic Store for the beta. I saw gameplay of the game and I was like, hey, that looks cool. And I went to go to play it and then uh, it was like, hey, it's exclusive in the Epic Store. And I'm like, yeah, okay, never mind. Try again some other time. Your your uh, tools degraded. The only news that it's coming for PC is it's coming to PC. Let me look it up then. Better hunting grounds. Epic exclusive question mark Is Predator Hunting Grounds a time exclusive or not? Do I, to, do I have to type timed into the search?
I mean, I guess uh, if I can't find the answer, then I guess it means no. Or yes. Yes? I guess it depends on the question. And the question is, is it a timed exclusive? Uh, I would say no. Since I can't find a direct answer that uh, has them saying it's a time exclusive. Usually when that happens, it's just exclusive. Rip. We will miss you again. If only ye had players. One person is here in time exclusive. Hmm. Either way, if it's not timed and it's just normal exclusive, it's not gonna have players. Not for very long. I'll have players for like a month, and then after that it's gonna be extremely difficult to find a match. Because everyone uses Epic as like their Fortnite machine. Epic says and, and gloats about the amount of users they have. But literally like 80% of them is, uh, is people who just played Fortnite like once or twice. Why are these swapped? Weird. I guess because I crafted the uh, the shovel first. Did you see the really stupid change that Overwatch made? Or I guess Blizzard made to Overwatch? No. Dude, the, the change they made, oh my god. I think it's actually the stupidest thing they've ever done. It's hilariously bad. Okay, so... They've just made it. So that some heroes are banned from being played. As in, once a week, a random selection of heroes get banned. Like, what the fuck? Why? That's so mega stupid. That's like the stupidest thing you've ever done. It makes zero sense. And a game about being uh, versatile and, and knowing all the characters and having the right tools for the right job. Having perfect counters. Not perfect. Having having solid counters. Why the hell would you limit the counters? Also, it basically just means that for a week, some people can be... Some people are like, hey, your favorite character... Fuck you, you don't get to play anymore. Play someone else, idiot. And then that player's probably like, okay, and then they start playing for a week. Very epic Blizzard, very epic game design. How about no? I mean, I think it, this goes for, like, for just general game design. Incentivize rather than punish. If you punish your players, they're just gonna go away. If you incentivize your players, it might not work, but at least you're not gonna push them away. Rewarding them for doing good things is much better than punishing them for doing bad things. 
You about the controversy with Echo? Uh, no. I didn't hear about the... Well, I suppose it is in quotation marks. So, I probably didn't hear about it. Since it is a controversy. They made them too female. Yeah, that's a weird one. I guess because in the concept art they, sh they were like super robotic and they kind of looked ambiguous and then in the actual game they have like a, fu a full female face. For that, I would say, uh, who cares? It's nothing to do with that. Is it some shit like her- it's the Twitter lot. Is it some shit like her body type change or some shit? Because if her body changed, she's a freaking robot. I always find it funny when people complain about robots, uh, ro uh, robot, robots, uh, uh, slash cyborg characters. In the sense that they're, they're, they're complaining about their, their, them changing their body or changing their face. Because, uh, I would say this is probably an excuse, but I'm going to say it for devil's advocate for purposes. But for the live-action Ghost in the Shell movie, for example, people complained that, uh... What's her name? Uh, something... M M Makoto Kusanagi? Is it Makoto? Mak Mako Mat Mako Ma Ma Matoko? Something along those lines. Make the protagonist. They complained that she wasn't of relevant ethnicity. Major Christian. Yeah, Major. I was thinking of her actual proper name. But Major is the, the def definitely the easier way to say it. People, But people complained that because Scarlett Johansson was playing her, that she wasn't of relevant ethnicity to the rest of the group. Even though she's literally a cyborg like a robot her entire her body's entirely fake so it could literally be anything and i don't like that reason i don't like that reasoning for uh right but I, I still think it's not the worst it makes sense i don't think it's a reasonable one but i i think it makes sense but i, I think complaining about that is silly in my opinion in general. So while I, while I don't agree with the reason to defend it, I agree that it's a silly criticism to make. Oh, I guess not. I guess I guess not silly. More like who cares? It's like people defending. Uh, what is it? What is it called when you defend a group that isn't yours? Because that's what they were doing. That's what everyone was doing. Every Western person was like, Oh, she's not Japanese, though. And then everyone who was actually from Japan was basically saying, Who cares? It's a, it's a, it's a Hollywood remake. It's an American remake of a Japanese franchise. It's gonna be American. And everyone's, everyone's like, But it should be Japanese. And, and the Japanese were like, Maybe, but it, it, it's American. Well, it's such a small thing to think. It's such a small thing to, to care about because they say it's racist and culturally insensitive. Yeah, they said it was a uh, whitewashing. It's like no, it's not. 
Scarlett Johansson is literally the perfect character to play Makoto Kusanagi. Makoto? I'm searching this up. Kusanagi. Motoko. I had it I had it right at some point. Motoko. She's literally the perfect person. She looks one to one. Minus maybe the Japanese uh, uh, ethnicity. Yeah, like, if you ignore the Japanese ethnicity part, where she was literally just wasn't born in Japan. Yeah. She actually looks pretty much identical to the character. Like, she pretty much looked one-to-one. -one. It was in... She doesn't look Japanese, neither did Major in the fucking anime. On, in, a, in a rise, she kind of didn't, yeah. In the actual, actual anime, she kind of did, but... Yeah, in the... In a rise, she kind of didn't. From what I remember. But also, it's hard, it's hard to tell ethnicity from, from animation, especially if it comes from that uh, ethnicity. Because then it looks a little bit more normalized in their... Culture. Kind of is, is different to full on is. But still, Scarlett Johansson was perfect for the role. She there's no uh there's no Hollywood actor that looked more on point than she did. There was like a zero percent chance anyone else, at least in Hollywood, would have looked any better as her, as Kusanagi. So, like, I can kind of understand the complaints, but, like, no? Can you not? Ah, oh, you can't. I just think it's a... No, it's, it's a silly complaint. I can understand where the, the concern is coming from, you know? Like, I can understand the worries of whitewashing. Because whitewashing is inherently bad. But this wasn't whitewashing. They chose an They were an American company who chose an American actress who fit the character pretty much one-to-one. -one. And people complained because she just wasn't born from Japan. When she supposedly should have. I will admit, she stuck out like a sore thumb in the movie. She stuck out in a cast that was entirely Japanese aside from her, almost. The toe wasn't Japanese, but uh, Bato and her were pretty much the only people who didn't look Japanese-ish. The rest of the cast looked pretty Japanese, and it was a bit noticeable. But like, I kind of don't care. I don't think it's a problem. I really don't think it's a problem, and it definitely wasn't whitewashing. They def they just did they didn't do it maliciously. It wasn't un it wasn't intentionally like we're gonna destroy this franchise. We're gonna ruin this Japanese franchise. We're gonna whitewash, turn into American. America's better. It's like no. No, it's, that's that's ludicrous. Insanity. Really just uh trying to think of what I want to do with the house. Chinese people didn't find the original anime of Mulan to be Chinese enough, that is a problem. There was also concerns of whitewashing with Disney's recent movies as well. When they were, uh, I think it was during the Jungle Book and the something else. Another live action movie, which no one really cared about. Aladdin.
Hmm. Actually, I'm going to keep this here for now. Would this be with turning Will Smith blue? I think it was that and also no, I think it was it was primarily due to uh the actors themselves. Because they, they recently corrected corrected it with Mulan that's cut that was coming out. I don't know if it, it if it did come out. But Mulan that was coming out they kind of, they made them oh, actually of their proper ethnicity. And I admit, it, it looks pretty proper. Seeing them as their uh, their proper ethnicity does look, it does make them look pretty cool and pretty pretty on point. But I don't think an, I don't think making it an American actor would have really compromised much. That's just me. I I don't think that it's a problem having American actors doing roles that are not there. That are not who they are. Just the whitewashing and when it came to making the extra Chinese, they got known that. That too. Put that dungeon wall away. Ooh. Sure to be uh, being put directly onto Disney, Disney Plus. I would say that's the smartest idea they could do. Definitely what they should be doing. I think that's what most companies should be doing, putting their uh, their movies onto some streaming platforms. I think that'd be smart. <sighs> Alright. Well, I shall see you later. Thanks for watching. I'll be streaming again later tonight. Maybe Mario Kart 8. Be fun. With uh, with Bippin and Speedy. Both of them. So, we'll see. See you later.